We are back, fellow knife enthusiasts, nuts. I'm C, and this is... Jewel. Just Jewel. And this week, it's about new fixed and folding knives from Kaiser, Gerber, Best Tech, and Medford, which we cannot wait to unfurl. Like a flag. But. Save the mother-in-law story. Okay, we know we got, you got one every week, just... Save it. Fine. Great. You know, but first, we're going to start with the Gerber Strong Arm, which for some reason I want to call the Strong Man. Mm. I kept doing it all week. I'm thinking it's like so strong it's your third arm. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. So, Dress sex first. All questions to just Jewel. No. Okay. Just fine. So this is a fixed blade, mm -hmm. nine point seven five inch overall, with an almost five inch black finish, stainless standard edge blade. The handle is glass filled nylon, with a diamond textured rubber over mold for better grip retention. Now this is the Coyote Tan version, but there's also what? A black version, along with serrated versions that come in both the black and the coyote tan, which I think we might have the serrated version in coyote tan. You ever tan? notice how oh. I always come up with three or four, but never four? <gasps> Look, yes. It's probably a skill there. <gasps> there they are. Yay. Okay. Go All ahead. Right. Ready? Made in the USA. Okay, <coughs> go ahead. Most <laughs> important. This knife also has extended tang, a lanyard hole. A striking pommel, coyote tan molded Zytel sheath. For the coyote I'm, tan I'm waiting. ones. There you go. There it is. With horizontal belt loop, snap on Molly strap, nylon retention strap, and a nylon belt strap. There's so many nylons there. That's amazing. It's got this thing that I like from them that you can adjust. I can't remember what other knife this was on, like the tri tip or something. Oh, man. I can't remember what. I think it. I don't know, maybe it wasn't the tri-tip. I, I don't know. I remember going, oh, that's neat. I like that. I can't remember, but it is a very neat feature. Neither can I. I can't remember which one it was. And then the, uh, that one back. Hold on. There's lots of pieces, because we got all three here. And then there's the black one, mm -hmm. which comes with, big surprise, the black one. Okay. Exactly. I have to say... Well, you know, you what? did we mention that you can also attach it to like a, a tactical belt sheath or I think the, sheath, the, the belt has to be like an inch, maybe 1.75, something like that. Mm -hmm. And you can also have like a drop leg belt mm -hmm. or... So what she's saying is the possibilities are endless. And you didn't see this was coming. It's only $69.99. And the dot com. You know what? We're stopping right now. You say AtlanticKnife.com with enthusiasm. I said at AtlanticKnife.com. Not bad. Not it's like what's it? Oh, we're getting some thumbs down over there from the camera <laughs> girl. Not getting a thumbs down. Sixty-nine ninety-nine at AtlanticKnife.com. Okay. Just because you enunciate each letter. So what you're saying is you noticed. It. All right. I'm always going on to what I think about the Random knife. I have one. to say, out of all the Gerber knives we've seen so far, I think I find this one to be the most, like, outdoor use. So tempted to smack the fly. I don't know why she <laughs> smacked the fly. It's most outdoor use oriented. I just, it's got all durable materials. It's a nice weight. And there's, like, 83 different ways you can carry it with the sheath and on your belt. I think it's a good knife and a good deal, so. So what you're saying is USA-made knife. Yeah. Fixed blade, mm -hmm. multiple carry options. I mean, all around, almost anybody can use this knife. $69. Exactly. Atlantknife.com. All right, so it beats the Bear Grylls knives, right? I think yes. so. Yes. Right. Bear Grylls should probably have this knife. That's what I was thinking. He, was, he, he speaks a lot like Earl, uh, Steve Irwin when he's out there. I've just hiked this large <laughs> mountain. 
I just peed in a cup, cup. and I filtered it. Filtered and now it. I'm going to drink it. With a coffee filter, <laughs> which you happen to have. Don't try this on Mount one. Everest. It's a coffee filter, people. Uh, yeah. Okay, so. I think I said what I needed to say. Okay. Awesome. Well, I'm Go ahead. About that. Okay. Then I guess we're moving on to the next knife. Let's do it. The Best Tech Irita. Irita. It reminds me a bit of the Best Tech Fanga. It does look a little bit like that one. A little bit. It's a little different because mm -hmm. it's got a longer blade, longer, longer handle, overall profile. Handles slightly wider. Blades it's a little got different. Extra uh, finger molds. If Design, you want to call them. sure. Yeah. But, but similar. I like the blade. When you said that, I had to get one to make sure. Mm, did I? Go ahead. Do you think? Well, I like this one a little better than the Fango. Because it's a little smaller. Yeah, and easier to handle, in my opinion. I also like the different cut they gave this one. I like a sharp angle upwards. Mm -hmm. And I like, of course... Call it upswept. Thank you. You're welcome. I didn't realize that. That's, awesome. why, that's why I didn't awesome. do the upsweeping motion there. <laughs> <laughs> Along with the carbon fiber and Reggie tin. That's nice, too. All right. Mm. However, if you're not a fan of red or carbon fiber, then you're in luck. Mm -hmm. There are a multitude of colors and materials to choose from with this one. I'm not going to go into like each of them. We'll just show you that uh, we got this red carbon fiber and G10 one, and then we got the tan G10. Mm -hmm. But you can also get a Best Tech Irita in either plain G10, which is right here. There's a few different colors, um, or a G10 carbon fiber combo. Exactly. So I think there's like three of those. Yep. Okay. So this line of lock is 8.75 inch overall mm -hmm. with an almost 5 inch blade. That's a 154 wow. cm steel blade, too. Satin finish. This knife, or that blade, operates on a ceramic ball bearing. It's deployed through, you guessed it, a jimped flipper. Yep. And jimping on the spine. I love jimping <coughs> on the spine. Lastly, it's got a black G10 backspacer and a titanium pocket clip, which matches the color of the pivot so this one it's like a silver so this one's got the same kind of gray silver and then this one's like so it matches the pivot accent yeah very good like very that. nice don't get irate get your best tech irita 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 <clears throat> starting on 90 bucks from ak deep down eliza feels it too atlanticknife.com mm. Enunciate that AtlanticKnife.com. I can't. I got to the FedEx driver every time they say, "Give me an email address." Sales at AtlanticKnife.com. <laughs> Our next knife on the table is <coughs> the new fixed blade Medford we talked about what? earlier. It's the UD T1. Uh -huh. But before we get to that, ah, before we get to that, make sure to like share, comment, and subscribe buttons. Those are the most important things. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. That way, I can keep providing you, AKers, with the latest knife reviews. And so I can keep providing the AKers with info and specs on the newest knives, along with in an endless stream of comedy. Okay, I, I can't concentrate. I get this now. Can you give this me a piece of paper to get the, the carcass, please? This was the, um... Please, I can't concentrate. His little body is just sitting there. Where's it at? It's right there. Yeah, don't! It. Don't just I, blow I, it! I, just I was gonna, do, do. This is the right twix, left twix thing, isn't it? Is it? Yeah, I get it now. I, I get it. Here, here! Dilly, dilly. All right. Moving on. You also, by liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing can be entered in our current YouTube giveaway for the Artisan Proponent. Yeah, did you see that? Came right over top of that. Wow. Artisan Proponent. Oh. It's wrapped in there. You're I could have distracted him by doing a little uh, yakety yak. Is that oh, what it's called? Is that what it is? Yakety yak. <laughs> a little Monty little Python. Little misdirection and magical illusions. Don't look over there. Up close magic. Okay, go ahead. And then it's in carbon fiber. Yep. Yeah. And while you're entering that giveaway for the artist component, mm -hmm. you can be entered in another on AtlanticKnife.com. You mean another blog. giveaway? Another giveaway? On the blog. That's yeah. two giveaways. Gang, some you better not do that. 
Go ahead. Do I have to? You answer the latest AK. Yes, I know. <clears throat> All you have to do is copy the person in front of you and answer the latest AK trivia question, and voila, you are entered to win a waddle. Of adorable D2 steel QSP penguins. Yeah. We only took out one because we're lazy, but... That is exactly why we took that one. I know that's why you did it. You're like, ah, let's just get this one out. <laughs> okay. Uh, that is, that is kind of sad. There's another it? one. All right. Okay. So, on to the Medford mm -hmm. UDT-1. Well, I got to tell you, I'm, ex I'm excited. I am excited about <sighs> it. One, two. Let's just open it up. Okay. Show everybody what it looks like. Oh, it's empty. It's empty. Oh, wah, oh, wah, wah. Okay, so. Look at there. Come on, though. The pouch. Look at the pouch. The pouch says I'm going to barbecue. The pouch is the power right here. It's a large pouch. It is a large pouch. I like the sheath. Mm-hmm. I like the knife. Well, speaking of... It reminds me... What? Of a Spartan Blades Alala. You took that from me. Because that's what I <laughs> Without said. Without the rest of the handle. <laughs> she don't even need it anyway. It's a Medford. That's all you got to know right there. Just MKT. We should end it right there. It's a Medford. Yep. All right. I don't know. Well. I mean, I if I'm going to be honest, I know he's probably not going to like me. I think the pouch <laughs> is a little more impressive well, than the... <laughs> speaking of pouches. Oh, no. I did you know, say later, though. You know how so. mother-in-law said this week? What? <laughs> she said, and I'm going to quote her. You're going to quote her. She thinks she has overstayed her welcome. Okay. Thinks. 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 Thinks she has. <laughs> what is Leah right there? I was thinking, whatever gave you that impression? How long has she been living with you? You know what? I remember I wanted to start that little running total on the uh, screen. It's it would be the number of days. Yes. I can't remember the exact day, but I believe, and don't quote me, don't quote me. I believe it was August 8th, 2016. Or was it 2017? 2017. Is that right? I don't know. Why are you asking me? And why are you asking them? They don't know. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Just gotta get nope. about it. 2016. Oh. oh. Okay. I said something about four years the other day. And she's like, it ain't been four years. And I'm thinking, why? Is this like the thing? Remember that movie? He's still breastfeeding. He's 48 months. <laughs> I have car warranties He's run out four. during this period. I mean, he has a car, car warranty. Yeah. I bought two I gotta drivers. I get my license renewed. <laughs> get my license renewed. Okay. <laughs> you know what? My passport expired. No, no. During all this time. Yeah, I mean, it does look. That sucks. Ah, uh, yeah. I can't leave, it, leave her in another country. Uh, all right, okay. let's get back to work. So. I'll do the specs for this one. You ready? Fine by me. I'll if that's okay the, with I'll you. just do the price. Okay. So, this Medford UDT is one, oh, I mean, UDT one. You get that correct. Yes. Is seven and five six inch overall with a cutting edge of three and a half inches and sports a S thirty five VN steel blade with a PVD coating. Mm -hmm. It's a longer version of the Thorn neck knife. I'm not sure if you guys are uh, familiar with that, but mm -hmm. it's on the screen, so there it is. This model comes with a beefy mill G ten handle. Beefy. Is that really necessary? Yeah, it's from something I can remember what. I thought it was Arby's, but now I'm second it may guessing. Be. And a standard hand formed. How can you have a standard hand formed sheath, Kydex sheath? If it's hand formed, it isn't the standard, is it really? Well, it's because kind of a standard looking, I guess. And then what's the point of hand forming it, you know? Exactly. Hmm. Well, with tech lock belt clasp. It also comes in either black G10 or there's a green G10 version. We like this aspect on the sheath. He does do the little extras, doesn't he? Yeah, I like I that. I give him that. I mean, I like the Made in USA sticker on the end of the box. Yeah. You can put that thing what, on the side of your what house. What sticker are you I referring know, to? I don't know. It's like, I can't see Ain't it. no mistake here. I think I might need my glasses. I like that part. All right. 
So you, will you go tell me this is a, uh... So, what do you like about it other than good sheath? Oh, I like that it's usable. Yeah. And if I were to use it, I wouldn't be too disappointed because I'd only spent $250 on it. Hey! At hey! 600 bucks. No, I think it's a remarkable bargain because it's one of the most <laughs> affordable Medford knives. <laughs> only $250 from AtlanticKnife.com. Oh, what's it? <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. I say, I'll handle the price. I'm going to do the price. Okay, no, well, No, mister, I got to have everything over here. It's just, you know what? You know what, for only $250. You know what, great. unfortunately, this brings us to the final knife. You know what, well, take your sign. <laughs> I hope I hope you choke on it. <laughs> unfortunately, this does bring us to the final knife. <laughs> However, it's an interesting one to end the show on. It's the Kaiser Mini Butcher. And you know what's funny about that? I think I posted a picture of that Mini Butcher Mini on butcher. Instagram. God. Lay your hand down right now. Lay your hand down right now. Put it on the table. I wasn't going to do Put it, it on the until table. you did that. That was a Robin pure Hood. accident. He, right. he, he doesn't need to tie it down. He just lays his arm down there. Be a man and lay your arm down there. <laughs> Be a man. <laughs> just lay it down there. Are you going to tell me to cowboy up? <laughs> no. Stop winding woman up. That's what I was going to say. Stop but... woman. Wow. I have to get... It must be Motion's 8. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't say that, Ocean's Eight. I said Robin right. Hood is what he does. Robin Hood. Still yes. from the rich. Okay. Anyways, I like this knife. I think it's a good uh, like uh, belt or pack carry, especially because mm -hmm. of the sheet that it comes with. It's not black, by the way. In case any of you are wondering, see a picture of it. It's not black. It's green. It's not currently black. <laughs> it may be it later. It could change, for all we know. Exactly. It's small, but... I don't think it's so small that you can't use it. Kind of like the, uh, we did a, is that a real steel mini one we did a long time ago? I had it as a keychain carry for a while, and then I realized it was kind of too small that you couldn't really use it. It had a, uh, like a titanium handle. Oh, wasn't that Bastion? I don't know. I don't that think was it was the, Bastion. That was the bro, the Braza? The, no! The mini, mini Cleaver, I can use that. That's oh, larger. Okay. This um, was smaller. It was like this big. It's like that big. Yeah, and it, it had a purple it handle, and I can't remember what type of steel it was. It was one of the first episodes we did. I but trust you. It was kind of small to be using it. But well, what's the steel on this? What is the steel on this? Do you know? Yeah, what I think we say later, but I think it's 154 cm. Okay, well then you know I I I like this then. Mhm. Mm because I mean, if if it was like the same type of steel as the Gerber. Yeah. And I'd be like, well, I don't know. But, I mean, it has its uses. This is a nice belt carry, mm -hmm. pack carry, you know. Everything's coming up butcher nowadays. Tops did the XXX Dicer. That's the one you're probably trying to think about. The Tidal Force. No, I don't think so. Oh, that's what you're thinking mini. That's right. Yeah, because this one's not as small as the one that I was talking about. You can actually use it. Mm -hmm. And then the Civivi Mini Bull Mastiff has the cleaver blade and... There's a lot of other knives that have the cleaver style. Yeah, I can't style. remember that small one, but like the Asada. Yeah. That had a cleaver style blade. Mm -hmm. uh, of course, tri tip. We mm -hmm. went over that. I'm sure we, you know. That's a four, yep. Yep. Yeah. Well, it ain't over to the Fat Lady Sinks. Can you say that again? It ain't over to the Fat Lady Sinks. They won't get that one. Ah, uh, they um, might. They might. Yeah. We'll, All right. just, we'll just give them a quick one because I don't want to go into full detail. So it's got the cleaver style 154cm steel blade. It's got the. <clears throat> I think it, I believe it's Macarta handle. Mm -hmm. A lanyard hole. Did you say this is extended tang? No, full tang. Full tang. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'd say full tang. And then it's got the Kydex molded uh, belt sheath, mm -hmm. pack sheath. Plain whatever. blade, flat grind. Yeah. So that one was just short, but can't beat that. All right. So. Fat lady singing now. Yep, she is. Because the show is over. Unfortunately. Yep, make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. That way you're entered in the artisan proponent. In carbon fiber. Knife giveaway. Every time you do a mat for it, come on. There you go. I should do it and just not put cheesy? the sheath on all the way and just back up. Back up. <laughs> a little more. Hold on, hold on. Boss man says no. Yeah, I went there. I'll go ahead. <laughs> At least it didn't hit anything that time. I thought it might, but it didn't. Okay, go ahead.
Right, along with answering the AK blog trivia question to enter to win three. Not one, not two, but D2 Steel Penguins. AK Hank included. Oh, I forgot about that. It's the dark jean one. Is it? Yes. Mm. Which is the real prize, if you ask me. Finally, don't forget to follow us on various social media channels like Facebook, Pinterest, YouTube, and Reddit. With that, I'm C, and this is Joel. You stole it from <laughs> earlier, and you didn't even let me say my own name. I'm sorry. No, you're not. You're you not didn't. sorry. Don't you say didn't. sorry if you don't mean it. Instagram. It was delayed. You know what's funny? What? This guy called. Your face. Your face is funny. And his name is uh, Rod. It was lame, I agree. And I'll keep wanting to call him Rich, because there's a coach called Rich Rod. All right. Just what Joel. A, that is hilarious. Because <sighs> that's means Rod Mm-hmm. And with that, we are signing off. <laughs>